which could mean big money for Broken Arrow. Similar to the Overland Park Soccer Complex in Kansas, some local entrepreneurs want to bring one to Oklahoma. It's going to be a three-phased approach. Noah Fontanez and partners say getting the Broken Arrow City Council's yes vote is a huge step. Now they're working to secure the funding for the $28 million project. As soon as we have that investment, we will be ready to go as soon as the city is ready for us. The city offered to lease the land to them and provide some of the infrastructure, like water and sewer lines. We have an extensive park system in the city of Broken Arrow. But a lot of times we don't have sufficient fields for everyone who wants to come in. When built, there could be dozens of teams kicking their way into green country each week. And at 14 kids per team with uh, friends and family, and uh, it's going to fill up our, our hotels, it's going to fill up our restaurants. Uh, they will shop in our stores. The current Broken Arrow soccer complex, Indian Springs, has 16 fields. Leaders say it will still be used for overflow. The new one will have 21 fields, most of them with synthetic turf. Plan proponents say the site that will have indoor space for other sports as well will score big for the area. The entire uh, green country area is excited about it. Uh, we think it will have a huge economic impact for the Broken Arrow City and the surrounding area. And the complex could create about 25 jobs. If all goes as planned, it should be built by the end of 2013. Reporting live in Broken Arrow, Beth Hawkins, 2 News works for you. Beth, thanks. We'll